OK, so this guide is going to show you how you can watch movies on your ONN 4K Pro Box with a file size larger than four gigabytes. As you can see on here, if I go into Explore, I've got an external drive, a USB drive plugged in. And as you can see down there, I've got a film and it's 4.6 gigabytes. And if I try and play it, I've had to blur it out, but the film plays no problem. Now there used to be a, a limit of four gigabytes on most devices such as the Fire TV stick and the older Fire TV cubes and also I believe on the older ONN boxes too. But I'm gonna show you how you can save films to an external disc or hard drive that are larger than four gigabytes that get around that limit. Stick around, all the details coming up shortly. Don't forget to like this video, share it and subscribe to my channel. Doing these three things help us make more great videos for you. So as I say, I've got a brand new ONN Watch 4K box. This is the Pro. And if I go into Explore, you will see here, there you go. I've got a film that's 4.6 gigabytes, which is larger than the four gigabyte limit that most of these cheaper devices have on them. Now, if I go into VLC player, it will hopefully find the, 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 the storage. So let's just detect it and let's just go down and into the storage and let's try and find it. There we go, there's the film. If I go into it now, it starts playing absolutely no problem, as you can see there. I've had to blur it out because I don't have the rights to show this, but you get the idea. It's working, it's playing. The quality of it is absolutely smooth. So how is it I've managed to do this? So it's all to do with the format of the drive itself, the file format. So if you right click on the drive and go to format, when you format the drive, you want to make sure that it's formatted to XFAT. Now, please be aware when you do format a drive, it is going to erase everything off of it. You will lose all the files, all the pictures, all the videos, everything off of the drive. So obviously, if you are changing the format of a drive, then do make sure you've got a backup copy of anything on it before you do it. If you want to check, first of all, to see what format your drive is, then all you've got to do is plug it into a computer, go to this PC, find the drive, right click on it, and then left click on properties. And there you will see the file system. It should say XFAT. Now, if yours says NTFS, then it will not work on a ONN box at all. If it says FAT32, it will work, but you've got a four gigabyte file size limit. This means if you've got a film or a TV show that's more than four gigabytes in size, then it will refuse to copy onto that device. It will just say that the device has run out of room when it hasn't. But if your device is formatted to XFAT, then you can put a file on there, a, a movie or a TV show up to 18 and a half billion gigabytes in size. Now, if you've got a file that's anywhere close to that size, then really you should be converting it to a more efficient format because that is absolutely huge. And there's no way that you're ever, ever likely to have a file that's going to be that size. So once you've so once you've uh, formatted the device to XFAT, then you can copy on there files, as I say, more than four gigabytes. And this will certainly work in a ONN 4K Pro box. I'm not about not sure about the other ONN boxes, but I pretty much know that it won't work on any of the Fire TV sticks and possibly cubes. But if you've got a Fire TV cube third generation, then that should be able to read NTFS file systems, which will be able to take a file size more than four gigabytes. So there you go. I hope this guide helped. And if it did, consider hitting that thanks button and making a donation to this channel or have a look through the description of this video. There you will find a link to my Amazon shop, links to Fire TV sticks, Fire TV cubes, Fire Stick accessories and any VPNs you might be 
after. Buying, subscribing and donating really does help support this channel. It helps me to be able to spend more time researching to bring you great videos like this. And whilst you're at my YouTube channel, why not stick around? I've got thousands of other videos for you right here, right now, covering all sorts of subjects. Hopefully whilst you're here, you're going to find something to educate you, entertain you, amuse you and maybe even save you some time and money. If you want to check me out on X, formerly known as Twitter, then you can find me at CWTEK. Check out my website at CWTEK.co.uk. Thanks for watching and speak to you again soon.